Imagine this. You are trying to go show your best friend your new diamond block that you got from defeating the Ender Dragon inside of the Nether or whatever. So, he walks into his Windows 10 computer and you walk onto your tablet because there's cross-platform play and you are the mobile gamer in this story. And then he can't sign into Xbox Live. Now, you say, well, this is not such a big problem. We are just 12 million countries separated apart and I can't do anything about it. And how am I supposed to show you my diamond block? Since apparently nobody can sign in to Xbox Live, I have thought of a different way of sending worlds to each other. This requires no downloads or anything like it, you just need iOS 12 installed onto your iPhone slash iPad. So to show you that this is true, I am going to be making an old creative world with two resource packs and a behavior pack. The behavior packs and the resource packs will come along with the world when you send it, so you can add as much as you like. You know it's a problem when the bar doesn't even show up. <laughs> so as you can see, we have a new creative world. Now I'm just going to build a little house out of terracotta. Comment down below if you ever actually made a house out of terracotta before. I personally hate the blocks of terracotta. Okay, and done. So what you want to do is you want to go into the mail app and create a new message. Now, you want to go out and go into files. So, you want to go into your Minecraft folder and go into games. com.mojan and Minecraft worlds. Now, what you want to do is you want to source by date. Because if you don't source by date, then you're gonna have some major problems with finding it. Now, this is the world you check by checking the level name. Okay, everything appears to be here. Now, you need to quickly hold it and take it into mail. It's a little bit laggy but it sometimes works. Okay, there you go. Now you have your world. So this is a fake Gmail address though, so don't try sending anything to it. If you're on the receiving end of da getting the Minecraft world, then you would want to get this app called Add-ons for Minecraft. If you already have it, then good for you. So if you now want to get it, then I think the easiest way to get it from phone to phone is to use Gmail online because you just get the attachments, which is this thing over here. I already downloaded it and then you need to go tap more, slide across and then copy to MCP add-ons. Just we now have, it says that it's a resource pack, but it's actually a Minecraft world. So you just tap import. And the way that you get it later is that uh, you have these little buttons over here. You want to go to studio, downloaded, no, sorry, imported, and then copy to Minecraft. So we imported the world into Minecraft on my cell phone now. So let's click play. And there we go, we got our world here, but just to let you know that it is real. I think this was our spawn point. Um, yeah, and then we got our world. Everything is exactly the same.